Jones wrote for Mom release. The first one is real simple, negative feedback. Have the negative feedback? Maybe not. It goes like this. Real simple. Makes the second. If growth hormone in the blood goes down, that will stimulate the anterior pituitary to release growth hormone. If growth hormone now gets too high, what will you get? gets too high, you will have what? Negative feedback. You will shut off the production of growth hormone. It's like the thermostat in your home. Right? The heat gets too low. What happens? The thermostat kicks on the burner. They make heat. When you had enough heat, the thermostat shuts off the burner. It's cold in your house. You tell the thermostat, you tell the burner, make heat. When you have enough heat, you shut off the production of this is called negative feedback. You all got that? Yeah. Now, there are other things that will stimulate besides negative feedback. And let's erase this and ask this question. Then we're almost done. What else besides negative feedback stimulates writing everything here, growth hormone release. And here's some of the things. One, big one, hypoglycemia. Actually, there'll be like six, four or five more of them that are going to do this. This is a big one, hypoglycemia. Okay. Increase of amino acids in the blood. So like after a meal, a few hours later, you're now going to be what? Digesting your protein from the meal. Your blood amino acids go up. What does go up to a Say, hey, let's build what? New cells, let's build protein. Does that make sense? Exercise. All of this makes sense. If you exercise, you're what? Building up your cells. You're always what? You have to synthesize new things. And I'll give you, uh, I might do all of that. I'll give you one more, okay? And wait till I do this at the end of hormones. This is a good one. Stress. Next column, what decreases growth hormone release? Um, one, negative feedback, why? Because too much. Sugar is getting what? Too high. You better what? Stop, you know, burning fat and saving the glucose. Three. I'll do four and five. Low amino acids in the blood. If there's not enough amino acids, then why the hell are you going to reduce growth hormone, right? You can't make any.
yesterday and they talked about this. If you take, there was a case in New Jersey that really 